Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. A piece of the Pikeville landscape that has been in place for the past 40 plus years is changing and it's all in the name of progress. Officials with the Pikeville Area YMCA have been operating the Pikeville City Pool for the past several years, but they say its age is showing and the costs to operate it have skyrocketed in recent years. So in its place will soon be a new field house and practice facility for several Pikeville High School athletic teams but the decision to permanently close one pool has opened the door to a brand new one. But it's just been recently that the city of Pikeville announced they were going to close their pool and wanted to collaborate with the, with the Y in planning this new development. It's very, very exciting. It's wonderful. It's dynamic. And we're just elated to have the city involvement in this along with other groups. Now that the Pikeville City Pool is gone, officials with the City of Pikeville are working with the YMCA to help bring its dream of a new pool to reality. We had hoped to build uh, two swimming pools at the YMCA since at least 2007. And one would be a six-lane competitive swimming pool and one would be a warm water indoor pool also. A recent marketability study on the new YMCA pool will be released next week, opening the door for YMCA officials to take the next step towards beginning construction. Uh, we're hopeful that we'll be able to get it done uh, in the 10 to 11 months time frame so that the pool at the city will be only shut down for one season. I know that the community is um, uh, worried that they're missing their pool for one summer, but when this gets built, then they'll be able to have water activities for 12 months out of the year instead of just two months. The new Pikeville Area YMCA aquatic facility will be built adjacent to the main building near Bob Amos Park. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.